Hello everybody and welcome to a new video. Today we are doing a 100% honest review on the new Elmer's Gu slime. I purchased three of their slime kits on Amazon so I have a total of nine slimes. Before we begin, I wanted to let you guys know that I am having a Halloween slime restock this weekend, Sunday, 2 p.m. PST. You can check out the Halloween slimes on my last restock video or on Instagram and you'll be able to purchase these at slimeyaoi.com. Here is the intro of it if you haven't seen it already. Anyways, these are the three slime kits that I purchased. I purchased Cosmic Shimmer, the Unicorn Dream Kit, and Retro Flash Kit. First off, we have the Retro Slime Kit. It came with three slimes in this cute packaging. I purchased this kit for $15.98 on Amazon, so about $5.33 each slime. The slimes included this kit were called Retro Pop, Just Fun, and Retro Glam, and each of them came with a different add-in. The slimes with the add-ins came sealed in plastic. I'll start off with Retro Glam. It is a hot pink slime that comes with rainbow foam beads and smells like a bubble gum with a hint of fruit. It's a pretty pleasant scent and this slime is super glossy and clicky. It's more of a milky clear slime. I am glad I started with this one because it has the stretchiest texture of all of these slimes. It's semi thick and more of a jiggly slime but it's super creamy and stretchy and I love how glossy it is. The foam beads are a fun addition to the slime. It is easy to mix in and it just adds some texture into it. There is a very small amount of fallout only when you're stretching it. Overall, I like this one. It's stretchy so I can make nice bubble pops and swirls. Because it's really stretchy, you can inflate it a ton. Next up, we have Retro Pop, which is a blue murky clear slime. So it's clearer than the last one, but not ultra clear. And it also comes with these cute iridescent music note glitters. This one is scented like blue raspberry, which smells super nice. And this slime is very clicky and glossy as well. It was not as stretchy as the last one. It's more of a slow stretch slime. I love the glitters that it comes with. It really reminds me of cotton candy colors. This is a more holdable and squishy slime since it's not as stretchy, but it still makes nice swirls and bubble pops. Lastly, from the retro kit, we have Just Fun, which is this red-orange clear slime. It is ultra clear, and it comes with these star glitters. I can't exactly pinpoint the scent, but to me, it kind of smells like a sweet cornbread. It is a nice scent. The texture feels similar to their regular clear slime, so it's semi-stretchy. It's squishy and holdable, and makes nice clicks and bubble pops. The star confetti is a little pokey, so if you're not really into that, then I wouldn't suggest adding it into your slime. But it doesn't hurt at all and isn't too irritating.
The next kit we have is the Unicorn Dream Kit. It comes with Unicorn Fluffy, Unicorn Butter, and Unicorn Magic. I purchased this for $15.98, but it's actually a dollar off right now. First off from this kit, we have Unicorn Fluffy. It is a light blue slime that comes with these holographic unicorn glitters. I'm not exactly sure what it's scented, but it smells kind of sweet and fruity, but it also smells like plastic or something new. The best way I can describe it is like when you purchase something new and it has that new plastic smell. It doesn't smell bad. It's just not my favorite. These glitters are super cute and I love that they're so sparkly and holographic. But first of all, I wouldn't recommend adding them all in. They do poke you a lot and it is a little irritating. A bit more than the retro slime with the star glitters. They also give you a ton of these glitters, so I would just recommend adding it a little bit and using the rest in another craft. This texture is similar to the pink retro one, so it is very stretchy and it's jiggly and very creamy as well. It is super glossy and clicky and makes really nice bubble pops and swirls. And like the pink one, it inflates a ton. Next up from the unicorn set, we have unicorn butter, which comes with this super clear unscented slime and this tiny block of pink clay. If you've seen my first Elmer's Goo review, it is the same clear texture. It's thick, semi-stretchy, and ultra clear. I do like this clear slime texture and overall really recommend it. So the clear slime texture by itself is already great, but it also comes with this pink clay. And when you add it in, it does stiffen up the slime a lot. It becomes super rubbery and more of a squishy slime that doesn't really stretch. So I do not recommend adding it in unless you want to soften it up with some glycerin or lotion. As I mentioned, the clear slime is already great, so you can just use the clay in a handmade slime or just sculpt it into something cute. Lastly, in the unicorn set, we have unicorn magic, which is this yellow slime that comes with four pieces of gold foil. I cannot pinpoint the scent for this one, but it does smell sweet and fruity and kind of like bananas. It feels like the same texture as the pink retro one and the blue unicorn fluffy one. So it's super glossy and clicky, semi-jiggly, and very stretchy. The gold foil idea is pretty unique for a store-bought slime and I love the idea. I added in two in the beginning and then two later. I also love how they described it on the box. It says it shimmers like a golden unicorn horn. Adding in the foil is super fun and I love seeing the gold shavings in the slime, but it does get stuck to your fingers and hands. It's not a huge deal since it makes your hands look super sparkly and you can wash it off later.
the last kit that we have is the Cosmic Shimmer Kit, and it comes with three slimes called Galaxy, Magma, and Stardust. These slimes shimmer and shine. This was $14.55 on Amazon, so a bit cheaper than the other kits, probably because it doesn't come with add-ins. I'll be starting off with Magma, which has to be my favorite one from this kit because of the color shift. It has this gold and copper color and just look at it. You can see the yellow and the red and orange. All of these cosmic shimmer slimes are super gorgeous and I love how they shimmer in the light. I have reviewed a cosmic shimmer slime in my first Elmer Goose review and it has the same texture and same scent. So it smells just like apple juice to me and it's very thick and holdable and semi stretchy. So it does have a slow stretch. It does make nice bubble pops and swirls though. Next up, we have Galaxy. This has a similar texture, so it's thick, holdable, semi-stretchy, and it also has a similar scent, so it smells like apple juice. It does look a little different though, so it doesn't have a color shift, but it's more of a dark green slime that has a gold shimmer. It is just as gorgeous as the last one, and I love how it shines differently. The magma one didn't have this problem, but this has some uh, pigment fallout on your hands. So your hands will be a little sparkly afterwards, which can be easily fixed by washing your hands. Lastly, from the Cosmic Shimmer Kit, we have Stardust, which has a similar texture, so it is thick, holdable, semi-stretchy. It smells like the same apple juice scent, and this one is just as gorgeous as the others. It has this dark teal to bluish purple shift, and I really love it. Just like the others, you can slowly stretch it to make nice swirls and bubble pops. This one also has a similar fallout as the last slime, so it does make your hands sparkly. That is all for this slime review. Thank you guys so much for watching and I really hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to comment down below which was your favorite kit. Mine is probably the retro one since it all had pleasant scents. Anyways, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!